Welcome my friends, so glad you could join me. My name is Wonka. Today we're gonna be playing PC Building Simulator. I got a hankering to build some bigger, badder PCs than we've been building so far. So if you guys like that idea, do me a favor, tickle that like button, leave me a comment down below. We'll get some more PC Building Simulator your way in no time. As always, if you're new here or you haven't already, be sure to punch your golden ticket by hitting that subscribe button. And without further ado, I hope you guys enjoy and I think you will. All right, we're back. Welcome. Let me slow down my sensitivity here. All right, so we got a bit of a, we got a bit of an interesting situation. Now I've kind of looked these up. We had um, this man over here, who wants a score of four thousand nine hundred and eighty-two, and then we have this guy over here who wants a score of four five thousand five and fifty-six. No five hundred. But here's the problem now. They're only giving, like, this guy's giving me 204, oh no wait, that's the wrong guy. <laughs> wrong guy, whoops. Let's actually collect on him, fuck him. I've got the money, but he's only giving me $375, and it's not worth it. Like, if you get these jobs, don't, don't accept them. Do not accept them. I'm even contemplating just quitting them, because they're not worth it. The only way it can be potentially worth it is if you luck out and the parts that you take from their computer, you need down the road, and they pay you enough to make it worth it i have tried every ryzen and the best graphics card i believe that i can let me actually double check because this one okay it's not the best graphics card i could get a 980 ti i guess um but it's got i think it's got the top ryzen 5 that i can purchase and um it's just it's not quite there let's run the let's run the benchmark on it see where we are oh my god look at this thing that's an old graphics card we got an old graphics card. Let's see if we got anything better. So yeah, our best one is the 980 Ti 6 gig. Right now, I think he's got a 980. So they have the 980 XL in there. Um, and just to show you too, like the 980 Ti is $495. So I'm, if that is what he needs, I'm already losing on that right off the bat. I can't remember what CPU is in this thing though, to be honest. So for this thing, we're just gonna experiment. It has a Ryzen in it, so that's no good. And um, a GTX 980, because this is the top Ryzen right there. There's, as far as I know, unless I just unlocked more, there's, 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 that's it. So what we'd have to do is get him a whole new motherboard, a whole new CPU, a whole new graphics card in order to get him anywhere close. Let's actually, I guess, run a benchmark on him if we can. Uh, we're not connected. I mean, the moral of the story here is these jobs are a little broken. And I don't get it. Like, did you not look at the job when you made this game and go, hmm, the math on that doesn't really, doesn't really work out, but fuck them. I mean, I guess if someone offers me 500 bucks to upgrade them from a three to a five, I have the free Ryzen. That'll make me like a couple hundred bucks there, maybe. Not really. Like, what do they want from me? <laughs> You know how much a motherboard and a processor and a graphics card costs? And they're giving me like 375? I get it, I get to keep their Ryzen, whoop de doo So we don't even need to t check this one because it has basically the exact same stuff. So what we're gonna do, and if it's not enough, then it's not enough. We are going to order the i7-6700 is the best one I can get. So we're gonna get two of those, like an idiot. Can't believe I'm actually fulfilling these. But I just want to, I just kind of want to build the top of the line PC that I can right now, just for fun. So uh, that's what we're going to do. We're going to get the top of the line graphics card, but we're just going to get one. Because maybe I can get away without upgrading that for the other guy. I'm not sure yet. I'm going to be like in debt though over these jobs. It's ridiculous. Wanted to build myself a nice sweet computer, but instead I guess we're just doing this. So hopefully this is enough. If not, we're making ourselves a nice beast computer and throwing these in the garbage. So this guy, our, our award-winning author friend, if you've been following along, he sold his computer. Fun fact. So, um, that was a waste of time. This person is a very interesting person. They're having problems with their computer, but they are a great believer in natural healing processes and the power of positive energy. So we need to, un we need to conduct an alternate repair session requires me to dim the lights in my workshop, light some candles, and fully relax. And I don't have to wear clothes. Clothes are optional. 
But um, apparently, I'm not good at that. I Maybe I should have. I don't have candles, but does that work? Are you happy now? Is this a candle? But apparently, it's too late. It doesn't matter. Because um, it had no effect. Who would have thought that the computer just didn't fix itself with healing crystals and rituals and the sign of its birth date? Curse you, Sagittarius! She wants me to buy healing crystals and arrange them around the machine as I'm fixing it. All right, lady, look. I'm not going to do any of that. I've, I've, I owe you three dollars. What kind of bank are you that you're all upset over three dollars? Must be a broke bank. I tell you what. Oh, thank you for sending me an article about yourself to your computer repair guy. I am so interested in your life and your accomplishments. I will definitely read this as soon as I have. All right, lights are out. We're closing down for the night, boys. I hope I hope your PCs never work, and I'm gonna I'm just gonna keep them forever. Oh, great. We got to pay the rent today. What a what a glorious day. Here's my order of expensive goods and a PC that needs to be diagnosed and fixed. So which one wants the 5,000? Was it this one? All right. This one wants wants the big boy toys. All right. So we're going to give it to him. Just disconnect all the wires and make sure when we're done, we reconnect all of the wires. We should probably disconnect the power if we're doing this. So there's a little... Uh, a little thing that's holding in the graphics card here. We'll just take that out. Slick to just completely disconnect this thing from the world. All right, so let's take the Ryzen out. Let's take the RAM out. I can't even see the RAM, really. Who, who turned out the lights? Whose bright idea was this? Screw this lady. I'm turning the lights back on. You're going from the AMD life to the Intel life, just like I did. Welcome. Welcome. AMD, no offense, kind of screws you when you have old stuff. But I guess their stuff is cheap. So I guess they're trying to say, hey, upgrade more. And then it's exactly the same prices as, as Intel because you have to upgrade more because we just discontinue updates for all of our stuff. And you can't play stuff and you can't do stuff. And your computer runs slow as molasses. It's great. It's great. Buy our product. AMD people. Do it. Do it. They almost didn't join up for this game. Fun fact. Literally, like, at release, AMD was like, all right, we'll hop on board. Let me tell you why. Because they don't want you to realize when you benchmark stuff how bad their shit is. All right? I hate you, AMD. You're great. Like, the Ryzen, new Ryzen, trust me, it's probably great. If you have one, it is, it's going to be great for you for about three years. Maybe two. If you're lucky and you don't really play the newest games, four years to five. And then um, it's going to be useless to you. So enjoy that when that comes up because that already happened to me. As you can tell, there's a very burning passion towards AMD here. But anyway, let's put the i7 in. This is our top of the line. This is our big boy on the block. And uh, we're going to open up this. Actually, I think we're supposed to put it on the inside on these graph or on these motherboards. I don't even know. It didn't come with instructions. Um, and he's going to need his new graphics card as well. This beautiful orange 980 Ti. Ooh, but first, we actually need to remove a new slot. Ooh, look at that beast. I mean, it's as beast as I got right now. We're, we're going to get more beast. Don't worry. Once we level up a bit. After these jobs and stuff, we're going to fly through some jobs and levels, and it's going to be great. But this is the first, like, big job we've ever done, so I figured, you know, you probably want to see it, right? So I think that's everything. We put his RAM back in. Oh, we need to put the cooling on, but first, we need to put a little bloop. Oh, I didn't check what his power supply is. <laughs> we might blow this thing up. I literally think this guy's ready to rock. The only thing I'm worried about now is what is his power supply? You're gonna make me take off the other side, aren't you? You know what, you make me take off the other side, I might not give it back. Think about that. It literally doesn't say. Silverstone, oh, it's a 550. There we go, okay. He should be all right, hopefully. Let's all cross our fingers and hope. All right, PCI lock is in. Side panel back on, and then we just gotta connect this thing and, and Pray that it's enough, because if not, I'm taking all my stuff back, and uh, you could just you could just be on your way, sir. Find a different repair shop, because I guarantee you won't find anybody 
who wants to upgrade to this kind of a PC for like $200. I don't care if they get to keep your used garbage. They don't give a damn either. We're on, we're running, we're benchmarking, and praying. And in the meantime, since we've already bought it, I guess we'll start working on this one the exact same way. I'm not going to show it twice in a row, because it's literally the exact same thing, just a different case. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit when it's done benchmarking. Please give me all of your best wishes and um, pray that it hits 5,000 and whatever the heck it needs to hit. Fun fact, though, this case has, um, has SSD slots right here, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure that's what those are. So hopefully there's actually SSDs in this game down the road. That would be awfully nice of them. All right, I don't really wanna do anything to this computer until I know it's gonna be enough. If it's not enough, I'm not wasting my time. I'll just send back the computer like this. <laughs> this is what your money was good enough for. That's it. You could have back the case and the power supply. <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh. Yes! Oh, we passed with flying colors. So we could have went maybe a little lower on the graphics card or something like that. I mean, I guess we could. Because we've already hit the benchmark. So the benchmark is green. And hell, if he's going to rip me off on the money, I'm going to rip him off on everything else, all right? That's, that's the way it's going down here. Because he messed with the wrong guy. You thought I'm an idiot and I don't understand prices of, th of things. Joke's on you, my friend, because I'm going to give you back the same PC with a screenshot of the benchmark with these po components in it and be like, look, I fixed it. Aha. Not. We're going to try. We're going to try. And if this works, -hoo -hoo, we're in the money because now we got free stuff. Well, not really free. We still have to pay for it, but at least it's ours. It's a little more work, but at least I get my stuff back. Hopefully when I do all this and boot it to the OS, it doesn't cancel that 3D Mark score and I have to do this all over again. That, that'll be karma for trying to cheat the game like this, but the game's cheating me, all right, out of the money. So, you know, fight fire with fire or water, or whatever Pokemon tells you to do. You know what? Just because you're a jerk too, I'm giving you the crappy Ryzen. I'm giving you a worse Ryzen than you came in with. Just because you tried to offer me $275 for all that work. That's what you get. That's what you get. I'm tempted to give you this $1050 too, I'm not going to lie. But it's brand new, so you know what? It's worth more than you're worth. I'll give you your crappy 980 back. Wait, wait, what did he have? Oh, he had this one. Actually, you know what? No. No. He pissed me off. You're getting the 1050 Here you go. Trust me, it benchmarks at... Whatever you want it to benchmark at, believe me, it, it does not. Does, maybe, probably not. There you go. Actually, that looks like too fancy of a fan for you, to be honest. Let's remove that. Here, you can have this one back again. Oh yeah, I guess I, I, guess I can give him his RAM back as well. He has a nice RAM stick, I kinda want it. But you know what, he might notice that. We'll let him have the RAM. I feel like as long as we don't run another benchmark, this might actually work. All right, ready to boot. The 3D mark has been hit. <laughs> oh my God, it worked. Yes. <laughs> oh, you tried to screw me, did you? Only I can screw myself. Trust me, it happens more than you think. All right, so we got to put in the good stuff for this guy. Neither of these are coming up used. This one's broken, so we're selling that. Um, so I guess if you just use it for one boot and benchmark, it doesn't count as used. That's also good, not gonna lie. Oh, I gave that guy a 1050 Ti too. Serves him right. It's a brand new one though, you know? <laughs> oh, I would so get sued if this was my actual career. And then we'll give him like a, maybe a Pentium or an i3. Oh no, he has his Ryzen, we can give him that. Although I kinda wanna keep his Ryzen. This was the initial guy that tried to screw me over. I have an extra deep-seated burning hatred for you too, my friend. All right, put the 10, or the 980 in. Sorry, not the 1080, the 980 Ti in. If it was a 1080 Ti, whoo, I can't wait for those. Um, hopefully this guy has a good enough power supply to handle it as well. Um, if not, that's you know not really my fault. Ooh, we don't have 
a fan that fits on this one that's oh wait i can take the fan off the other guys though like real quick all right let's go get a fan get it from this guy actually we still have to diagnose you do you have a fan that i can use i think you do I, I promise I'll give it right back. You didn't you didn't do anything wrong. I mean, you're a little weird with your healing crystals on a PC and stuff, but you didn't do anything to piss me off. So you're, you're cool in my books. Broken. Damn it. <laughs> of course, it's the part that you need replaced. You son of a... Mm. All right. So here, you can have this fan. And, um... I'll give the other guy the other fan. Congratulations. You get the nicer fan. That didn't sound very good. Hopefully his power supply is not going to crap out and ruin all these parts. It should be all right. Ooh, the fans on the front aren't even on. The hell? Are they not wired up? Is the power supply unable to support them? <laughs> Whatever. We're going to hope for the best and then we'll give him back what he came with as well maybe even worse because you know screw these guys am i right so one thing we're gonna want to do for this person is give him a little dusteroni is this part of the healing process this is natural right it's just air compressed but it's just air all right so we took out all the dust and we know it needs a fan we might have to wait and order this person a fan though but guess what? We're going to have a nice i7 and a nice 980 Ti to throw into a computer. I also want to try and hit level 6 so I can get the PC storage covered. Because I don't know what to do with my PC if I just make a whole new one. I don't want to throw this one out. So I can put it in the PC storage cupboard maybe. But I need level 6. So that's the goal today. Oh, look at that. It's done. Congratulations. You booted to success. Now I could just leave you by the door once I finished your case, but you're not getting off the hook that easy, my friend. Even though I do have two of these, and I could give you what you asked for, I'm not gonna. But what I am going to do is I'm gonna leave you with the update to Intel, all right? I won't, I won't put you all the way back to AMD, mainly because I don't wanna waste my own time. So what you're gonna get, though, is a nice, Beautiful. Pentium or a Celeron? Which one do we give them? Ooh, the Celeron looks like it's worse. So let's give them that one. Here you go, bud. Look at that. It's what you've always dreamed of. Maybe next time you won't try and screw people like me over. All right, friend? That's, that's what we're going to hope the lesson is that you learned today. All right. Also, I got you a nice, beautiful used R7 this I used to make gaming videos on this so you know it's not terrible it's not good either there it is all right you enjoy that me to you couple of angry customers right there Mr. T Conrad and Mark Field you guys can go screw yourselves wait what did that say oh I changed the fan so I have to prove that this thing can boot to OS again this is where that quick connect would really come in handy. I might have to buy it soon, but I'm trying not to because it's money that I could put on computers instead. Missing cables? What you talking about, Willis? Oh, I don't think I cabled up that fan on the CPU. Nope. <laughs> oh. Sorry, didn't mean to break anything. There we go. Now we just got to put this back on and we're good. All right, leave this thing by the front door and we're good to go. We got to buy this person a fan. We should probably see what else they might need. But I can't really... I probably can boot it for like two seconds without the fan. All right, I know there's no fan and I know this is terrible. No CPU found. Okay, so the whole CPU is busted. It's all busted, Buster. So wait, can I check my inventory here? I want to know what cooling I have. Okay, just this broken fan, that's all I have. Cool store. Look at the CPUs I have, though, holy. So she had a Celeron. You know what, I gave away my last Celeron, so you're getting an upgrade, congratulations. You win a prize. 
a brand new Pentium G4400. Um, and I gotta get you a new fan still, so, uh, sorry, sorry. Your rent is now due. You owe us $500. All right, there you go. We have received your $500. Hope you enjoyed your month. I didn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I'm overdrawn. Screw off. All right, collecting money. Free money from these guys. Hope they're not too upset. Ooh, full tower. This is the big bad boy on the block right here. Might have to go with that one. How much is it? 300 bucks. Yowzes. I don't know. I don't know, but what will I wear? See, this is where I need you guys. WW Dad. Um, this is where I need you guys to uh, help me out a little bit, you know? This one and this one and even this one can hold bigger power supplies, bigger graphics cards, bigger fans. But these ones are a lot cheaper and they look pretty cool. All right, we're doing we're doing we're doing one of the cheap ones because we don't have a ton of money, and I want to do this legit. You know, we're not gonna go in debt over a three hundred dollar case. All right, so we're gonna get an eighty dollar one, and I think just because we have an orange graphics card, it won't go too well with the red. So I think we need blue or purple blue. We're gonna get the blue one, eighty bucks, add it to cart, and. Uh, Let's see what we might need here. Actually, no, we'll, we'll, we'll build it slowly here. So we're just gonna buy this. We got a case and we got some stuff. 51 bucks left to my name, but we got a lot of PC parts in the pocket. So that's good. Friday, everybody loves Friday. Ooh, this is my case. Make the girls go crazy, yo case. All right, let's take this. I just wanna see, can I put, oh, nice. I can store my own computers by the door. That is wonderful. First thing we need to do is replace the fan on this one. That should be easy enough, and hopefully that's all. Get you that nice cheap fan, there you go. Ain't that nice. Apparently though, that's not the only problem, because the uh, diagnose and fix still did not fix. So let's turn it on here. Oh wait, I gotta, I gotta plug the fan in. That could be why. It did boot, so I think as soon as I plug the fan in, the diagnose and fix will be fixed. Yes, excellent. Now we just boot it while it's booting. I'll put the uh, the sliding door back on. No healing crystals required. Here, I'll rub it on this cherry blossom. There you go. Now you're now you're set. We got two identical looking PCs. This is the uh, the one case the the case that I can't pronounce. This is it. If my PC comes up, like case, parts, etc., we'll definitely be building it. There you go. There's your 8 gigs. And he also wants the CPU upgraded, so let's see what he's working with. He is working with an i3-6100. That might actually be hard for me to upgrade. Yeah, I only have an i3-6100. Or upgrade him all the way to an i7, but that's not gonna happen. <laughs> Sorry, friend, but that's okay. Let's see if we can fix this guy's with what we have. We're just slowly collecting parts, and then it's just going to make jobs easy as pie afterwards. So, this guy wants the graphics card upgraded, which is just a 970. I should have something that's better than that. What we can actually do now... Oh, shoot, what did he have? He had a 970? I think he had a 970. So, what we can actually do now, because I bought it, is go to this part ranker. I bought this because I was trying to figure out how to do those upgrade jobs for cheap and within the budget. Turns out they're just broken. So there you go, now you know. Um, so we got all the way to the bottom. We have the 1030 SC. And he has a 970. So we gotta go up a little bit. So he's got the 970. Let me just double check actually what he has. <laughs> what did I just take from him? So anyway, I could throw most of those in and it would be fine. But I'm just trying to show you how you could do this legit. So he has the 970 Gamer XL, which has a benchmark of 2,197. So you can just go up. Anything above here is is better. 
So I think I have a 1080. That's probably the easiest. If we have an R9 or something, we could put one of those in. So let's check. We have we actually have a, an RX here. What's the cheapest one that I have? The R9 380. And I think that was an upgrade. R9. Oh yeah, R9 290 is an upgrade. But I should probably put the 980 in because I think the R9. Oh wait, what? Oh, I only have up to this. So where's the R9? 300 series oh it's actually worse the 970 as far as what i have unlocked i guess is actually pretty pretty up there there's not not a ton better than it i could put the rx 470 in though do i have one of those yes rx 470 and it is the next cheapest so that is what we're gonna do generally if you go by price you can you can kind of decipher the exact same things but it's nice to have that there in case you're, oops, in case you're lost or just have no idea what buttons you're clicking and you're just spamming things like me, apparently. So we'll put the RX 470 in. There you go, my dude. Hope you enjoy it. It needs to actually be plugged in. And uh, we got to do a benchmark. All right, so that's almost done. This one, I need to actually order a better... CPU, so we can't do anything with that one. Uh, that one actually, yeah, we still need to work on. So let's take our brand new case and see what we can do here. Look at it in all of its glory. It's not as nice as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> but it's all right. It's a good starter gaming case right here. Nothing fancy, nothing expensive either. I mean, for $80 case, what did, what did you expect? And yeah, look at that. We do have SES. SD slots, which is great. Came with a case fan. We could probably replace that for an RGB one if we so choose, which we so choose. Oh, there's one up there too. All right, so what we can do is start building our PC. We're gonna make this one the Intel i7 one, seeing as I went ahead and bought those beautiful components. We're going from zero to hero pretty quick just because those guys tried to screw me. So uh, a special thanks to them because now I'm moving up in the world a lot faster. Actually, you know what? I want a better I want a better motherboard. I don't want the basic motherboard if I'm putting an i7 and a 980 Ti, all that good stuff in it. I, I want a better motherboard. So we're not actually going to build that just yet. These are the complete computers. This one needs... Something better than an i3-6100. Okay. <clears throat> so what you want to do at the end of the day here to best optimize your, your shipping costs is you want to collect and discard everybody that you, you completed. All right. So I bought my PC from you a while back from a guy called Tim, and it has always seemed to run a bit hot. I thought there was nothing to be done about it, but a good friend of mine, Dr. Waterman, told me of how you fixed this machine, and so I was wondering... If you could have a look at mine as well. Oh, okay. So the doctor who was wanted the free job sent me this person who's actually going to pay me. So that's nice. Thank you. Okay, this is the healing crystal lady just for background. I'm assuming it's a lady since her name is Hazel. Thank you for attempting to repair my computer. However, on receiving it, I've noticed that it still doesn't turn on. Even though it turned on, it, the only way I can complete it is for it to turn on. Needless to say, I'm disappointed I have to teach a so-called expert how to fix a computer. This lady's looking for a fight. One of my friends at the Woodsy Alliance tells me there may be a malevolent spirit to blame. I am inclined to believe them. Oh my. Could you check my system for any malicious energies and purge them? So you got a virus and you're blaming me. I didn't get all the details, but my friend's suggested method includes... Refit the processor with a highly diluted solution of thermal paste. This has the effect of triggering the computer's own cooling mechanisms, which may aid recovery from any malware infection. Burn the thigh bone of a blessed sheep in the presence of a computer to drive out the evil spirits. If you cannot e easily obtain an ethically sourced sheep bone, a chicken drumstick will do from KFC. Place round magnets at the energy points on your forehead and your upper chest. They can be held in place with sticky tape. Important, do not get too close to the computer while conducting the ritual or the magnetic essence will blank the hard drive. <laughs> oh, 
this this character. I like you better than the author, though, lady. I'll, I'll give you that much. So this person needed something better than an i 360 100 This person just needs a diagnose and fix. Should be fixed just from a little thermal paste or something like that. And this person needs viruses to be removed. So that's a cheat day as far as buying parts goes. So I can appreciate that. So what we're going to do is first off get this person their CPU. They need better than an i3-6100. Oh, we can go to the i3-6100T or we'll go to the i6300. Let's go top of the line now, 170, 160. Ah, it's 10 bucks more. Let's go top of the line, i3 for them. Move them up in the world. Actually, no. Wait, I actually have an idea for this. We might be able to complete it today. Let's try it. Because in our PC, you may remember, we put an i5 of some form, which uh, isn't, isn't too expensive, isn't too fancy. So what I think I'm going to do, just to save myself a little bit of time, is give them the i5, and I'll give this PC the other i7. Why not? Actually, since we're upgrading it, Let's just put an i3 in this one. Because we're not even going to really use this computer as soon as we finish the other one. So it really doesn't matter. Let's just put an i3 in here. And uh, put the fan on. I'm really bad at remembering to wire up the fans today. I keep putting on the, the case door and realizing after. Now we can actually upgrade them without wasting a day. Look at this. This is thinking on your feet, people. Throw the i5 in. Merry Christmas, you can have my old i5. Alright, that was easy enough. Make sure you hit that like button, because if you guys hit the like button for me, Lots of good things happen, okay? And we can grow and do giveaways and, like, subscribe and all that good stuff, okay? Take her easy. <laughs>